The project, which started in 2019 between the Ministry of Education, Arts and Culture and Namibian Correctional Services, was delayed due to COVID-19. The identified schools in and around the capital will receive two classrooms each, with the exception of Dach Briek School, which will receive three, while Mix Settlement will have an ablution facility. At Acacia High School, two libraries and science laboratory rooms are nearing completion. NCS handed over four completed classrooms at M.H. Khriev and Gamam's primary school. For the purpose of rehabilitation activities, the Namibian Correctional Service engages inmates in various trades. These programs are meant to impart the inmates with much needed employability skills that are critical for their rehabilitation and eventual reintegration into society, not only as law-abiding citizens, but also as positively contributing members of the public. Because of the nature of public-to-public -public partnership, the project is being implemented at a low cost set at $4.2 million at all nine identified schools. The support from Namibian Correctional Services, you are truly our friends in education. You agreed to construct classrooms as part of the government public-to-public -public partnership agreement. It demonstrated the commitment to contribute to the development of Namibia's most precious commodity, its people. The principal of M.H. Khriev commended the initiative, saying it will provide a conducive environment for the learners. It was constructed during the peak of time of COVID-19, but that did not deter the contractors from com completing the project. I salute the officers for their commitment the execution of duty with precision and discipline. The classrooms were constructed by 14 inmates. Selima Henok, NBC News, Ventug.